हेलो टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट व्हाई द नॉर्मैलिटी इज इम्पॉर्टेंट और व्हाई डू वी चेक द नॉर्मल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ डिफरेंट वेरिएबल्स व्हिच आर इन्वॉल्व इन आवर स्टडी सो नॉर्मैलिटी बेसिकली मींस यूनिफॉर्मिटी ऑफ द डेटा सेट सपोज आई एम कंडक्टिंग सम स्टडी एंड माई स्टडी इन्वॉल्व टू और थ्री डिफरेंट वेरिएबल्स सो इन ऑर्डर टू अप्लाई एनी काइंड ऑफ मल्टी data analysis technique or any statistical technique the condition is whatever data set you are having it should be normally distributed or the different variable should follow the normal distribution so the normality means the uniformity of the data uniformity means my sample should be withdrawn from the population suppose i am conducting any study which is related to the covid patients so whatever sample i will take it will be directly withdrawn from the covid patients like it will include all the covid patient it doesn't mean like it will include covid as well as non covid uh, patients so as a researcher i have to ensure that whatever uh, sample i have taken it is uniform uniform means it has been withdrawn from the population so this is the first uh, uh, like you can say uh, the reason why do we check the normality the second reason is whatever be our research findings we can generalize our findings to our population suppose we have withdrawn some sample we are conducting some study so whatever be the findings of our study we can generalize those findings to our population so that's why normality is important if someone ask you why normality is important so you can answer like normality is important first in order to ensure the uniformity of the data uniformity means my sample has been withdrawn from the population and second is the uh, this uh, generalizability of the result whatever be the findings of my study i can generalize those findings to the population so for both these two reasons we need to check the normality of the data set now the question is how do we check the normality so in statistics basically there are two types of test that is kolmogorov smirnov in short it is known as ks and the another one is a sapiro wilk test in short it is known as sw and for both or if any one of the test is having the significance value which is greater than 0.05 then we will say the given variable is normally distributed so this is all about the normality thank you so much